What's good, YouTube? Sorry, G3. Live from the 313. And tonight, I'm bringing my quick night method. So, I just got home from school. And I had a real long day. I'm tired. And so, no matter how tired I am, I get this last session in before I go to sleep. And this is what I do. This is my night method. So, I get in from school, <clears throat> take off the dewy. I wash yesterday, which is um, two days early. I usually wash uh, a week after a fresh cut, but the stuff I've been using been growing my hair so fast. I'm going to wash and go get a fresh lineup. Well, I washed already. I'm going to go get a fresh lineup. Um, but I'm going to show y'all. So... I've been dry brushing all day. Mm. Show y'all right quick. Been dry brushing all day. Alright, so at night. Y'all know I'm a fan of using my growth products at night. So I'm going to show you the top growth products that I got. <clears throat> Alright y'all. All these products I either use for my crown or my whole head for my uh, night method. So, do go and make it thick. Hollywood Super, Super Grow, Hollywood Beauty Super Grow. Um, Y'all know my method, Hard Brush Super Grow method. There you go. This joint. Yes, I use castor oil for hair growth. Alright, it just does. New pickup. New pickup. Organic hair fertilizer. Um, this and the regrow going to be my new combination. I'm going to be alternating these. Um, I've been on that regrow for about a week. Tomorrow will be a week. I've been on this regrow. And um, it's working real good for me so far. So tonight... Um, I'll be using to show you the regrow. All those products I showed you is good for growth. My favorite growth products. Um, yeah. So what I always do at night is start off with a medium. Um, really. Excuse me, I'm so tired. Um, I comb my hair, comb the product in, so, um, boom, about that much. The purpose of this night method is to, um, get whatever product I'm using for growth into my scalp so that when at night I'm resting, it can soak in without no disturbances, no unragging, no brushing, no nothing. So as you see, I can rub that in. With the grain. Since I'm working on my crown, I'm trying to get my crown back like I used to be. Um... I know you think how it used to be, but yeah, how it used to be. Um, putting the growth product right directly in there. And spread it around in the direction that you brush. Alright. Next. Next, I'm going to um, comb it in with the grain.
small in. I'm going to give y'all a combing tip too. Peep game. You ever seen somebody stand the comb up straight up and down like this and just rake through their hair? Tear up your connections. If you want to comb for connections, you want to comb, lay the comb, and press down. Comb, press down. See how it's flat? Not like this, but like this. So it's kind of like comb and laying it down at once. Let me show y'all. See? Now you can do this at a fast pace because you're still laying it. You lift it and laying it. Lifting and laying it. Lifting and laying it down. So, y'all got a part of me. I'm kind of speeding because I'm really tired. I had a long day. Um, comb and lay it down. Comb and lay it down. Comb and lay it down. Usually, I suggest you comb for about at least five, six minutes, combing it in. Comb at consistent angles. Lift and lay, lift and lay. For video length purposes, I'm going to try to keep it short, you know what I'm saying? So, night method. Comb your growth product in with the grain. Next, you start brushing with a medium. Tonight, going to be my medium CQP. Y'all know I'm on my all CQP method. So, here we go. Weak side first. At night, I'm trying to vigorously stimulate my scalp with the growth product. Um, I'm trying to brush with the medium to distribute the product through and stimulate my scalp for growth. Cool? Copy? Got me? Capiche? Shout out to Capiche. So usually at night, I start off with 30 strokes for my for my weak side. Then I move on just to evenly brush all the way around. I won't count. I only count strokes on my weak sides. You ain't got to do it. That's just me. So <clears throat> I work my way around. Brushing it in. With this medium, trying to get all the way down to the scalp. Like this over here, this this thin spot right here. One of the main reasons why I'm using a growth product right now to try to help improve my weak spots, my thin spots. So, like I said, I start usually with weak side first, but right now I'm just making my way around. I'm trying to show y'all what I do. Okay. So. I suggest at least brushing um, the growth product in with a medium for at least 15 minutes. Tonight, I ain't feeling it, so I'm going to uh, move on from the medium. Mm. 
Move in front of medium. Moving on from the medium to <clears throat> my premium, my OG premium. And uh, I don't need anything else but secret to what I do. Somebody might say, oh, you overdoing it. No, no, pineapples. This is what I do. So, y'all know I'm a King Oil fan. Gold label King Oil. Boom. I like to finish everything with oil. Smells like baby oil, but a little bit more almondy, if that makes sense. So, I finished all my sessions with oil. Why? For the overnight shine. And it helps with the frizz once I use my soft brush. Copy. So medium brush just to disturb your scalp, to distribute the product, and stimulate your scalp. Soft brush, of course, to lay down the frizz, chisel up the connections, and lay it down smooth for the night. So, here we go. Just going to be a speed course for y'all, right quick. Boom. What side first? Weak side first. So, alright, like I said, usually I start with 30 strokes, but tonight it won't be 30 strokes because I'm trying to lay it down. Just going to polish this off with the premium. Okay, um, take the back. Now I know y'all thinking you ain't touched the stuff in your crown yet. You ain't stuck, you ain't touched the stuff in your crown yet. This is why. One, test your muscle memory. Remember, you put product directly into the crown for connections, which you're supposed to do. Brush from the crown through the hairline. So by the time you make your way around, you check out your crown and you see how much product is left in the crown, if any. You check that out. See it? They're pretty good. So what I'll do, go at the crown with the tip of the brush, sort it out, work it through. See that? It's alright to leave some smack dab in the middle. And if you work it through a little bit, finish brushing everything else. This night, <clears throat> night method can be used as your day method too. Say for instance, you haven't brushed all day. You've been gone all day and you haven't brushed. Get you 20-30 minutes. Right before bed. <clears throat> brush your product in. Alright, so at this point, I'm ready to plastic bag once again to lock in my progress. Like Young Wavy said, you don't need to keep rubbing. Just a few strokes each spot.
You having problems with your sides? Rub a few extra times on the side. cap this off with this two bitten floozy Pete I can't stand this mug why it's too thick this pink shit too fucking thick strings too fucking thick man I'm not gonna lie I wore it last night because I originally wanted to do the review last night but I had a long night so I'm gonna wear it for y'all one more night Wrong. Too thick. Too thick. So. It's too thick. Today was really hot here in the D. Um, I woke up with it on this morning. Hot as fuck. Hot as fuck. When you tie it, this shit back here is too thick. If you a bow tie nigga like me, this shit too thick. Look at that. Thick as fuck. And you know they say don't trust a nigga with the cape out, so I can't roll like that. I use it like to twist it around and tuck my do-rags once again. Too fucking thick. But I'm going to do it anyway. This is how I like my do rags. Now, I gave you this. The whole is the whole stays just like you see it overnight. It didn't slide off last night. See that? It left, it left my hair smooth. The lay was good, but it's too thick and it's too hot and it's not necessary. So, I'm going to get us a fair two more nights review. And after that, it's not going to wild me no more, but whatever. I use it for my night methods so that this damn thing can smell like do grow or whatever the fuck. And my other shit can smell like regular good shit. So, uh, that's, that's basically it. Night method. <clears throat> Comb your your growth product in. At least six minutes. Brush in your product with your medium brush for at least 15 minutes. Finish with a softy of your choice. I'm not going to tell you what brushes to use. But before you use the softy, hit it with some oil. King oil, whatever, some juices and berries, whatever, olive oil, castor oil, whatever oil you like. And finish your brush session, maybe five minutes, with a softy, plastic bag, do rag up, satin up, so rag up, so many wave up, whatever. Um, that's basically it. Um, I'll be back in the morning with my actual review on... This sorry ass satin bullshit. And um, that's it. Hope y'all liked it. RG3 over and out. Spring.